Hello everyone, welcome back to Piston Cup Productions. Yes, it's been a while since I've done a video, but it's because I've been waiting for this day. The official release date of the Toy Story 4 merchandise. I am not just a fan of Pixar cars, but also a fan of Toy Story, The Incredibles, and all those other franchises made and created by Disney and Pixar. There's so many movies that I enjoy by this company that it's kind of hard for me to just stick to cars. I want to expand on what I'm reviewing here and especially on my second favorite franchise by Pixar ever, Toy Story. Now, on April 22nd is when they released the toys and unfortunately they weren't out on my shelves and that was the situation for many, of pe many other people from what I know. So in this video we are going to take a look at this Target haul that I have from, well yeah from Target, featuring two Toy Story figures and I was going to get another one but it was just way too much money. They're kind of overpriced, and, well depends. We're going to determine if they're overpriced or worth it in this video. I got two Hot Wheels and we're going to take a look at it all in this video. So we're going to start with the bag here from Target. So quite a large bag that I got of um, items. Here's the first one. It's the Character Cars Buzz Lightyear Hot Wheel. And I believe these are, from what I've heard, the same as the past releases as far as these four right here. But these four are going to be brand new releases and some of already are hitting Target stores from Instagram pictures that I've seen. Hopefully I can find a picture and I'll put it up on screen right about now. So um yeah, that's Buzz Lightyear. We also have Woody himself right here. These are the twos I really wanted. Just wanted Woody and Buzz. But I will get Forky, Ducking Bunny, and Bo Peep as well when they come out. I'm not too sure about Duke Kaboom. Don't know much about him. So taking a look at the bag right here, first item we have is the Sheriff Woody with interactive drop-down action. Over 70 sayings, huh? Hey, howdy, hey! I'm Sheriff Woody. Great to see you. Now remember, if you see anybody coming, you gotta drop or freeze. Got it? I'm pretty sure that's Tom Hanks. I'm not too sure. We're gonna compare his voice, the one from this one, to the signature collection ones up there. Same thing for Buzz. When I was in the store, I did notice right off the bat that Buzz did not sound like Tim Allen, unfortunately. Um, I don't know if this is 100% Tom Hanks, but we'll find out in this video. And there's a box on the back if you want to pause and read there. And now let's take a look at Buzz Lightyear. Here's Buzz Lightyear. Greetings. It doesn't sound very authentic. with interactive drop-down action. Part of this interactive line is also Bo Peep and Forky so far. I was gonna get Bo Peep, that was the other figure I was gonna get, but for $70, and it uh, just feels a little bit too overpriced, and it feels like, I feel like they're asking a little bit too much for these. If Bo had the drop-down action, then that would make more sense, because they're using a lot of technology. But for now, I'll be back with these two unboxed. Now, a quick look at these figures out of the blister, or the little package sleeve, I guess you can say. Buzz's wings or his jetpack is out, um, it's a separate piece outside. This is very, very um, loose in comparison to this one over here, where it's a lot harder. Um, Woody's legs are positioned this way and they are hard. Those are just fabric and they can dangle and that's why he's on a stand. These right here though are gonna help him stand up because he doesn't have a stand. Um, but I'll get into more details as soon as I take these guys out. But just wanted to mention how they're positioned inside the package. Alrighty, here are the two amigos out of their package. And a quick look at their instruction sheets here. Haven't gone fully in detail with these instruction sheets, but we will together here. Toy Story 4, Buzz Lightyear with interactive drop-down action. Retractable helmet, pull-out wings. Surprisingly, it has pull-out wings. Unfortunately, they don't work with the button. But I mean, hey, at least it's got the wings. Talk buttons, posable arms, no laser unfortunately. Two ways to play, 68 plus sayings and sounds. Buzz drops on command. And I like this little part right here. Congratulations on your, on, well yeah, on your purchase. This Buzz Lightyear talking action figure recognizes phrases and reacts. He drops down when going into toy mode, just like in the movie. He stays in toy mode until you tell him it's all clear. Please read the following instructions carefully. Turn around your new friend. We can recommend steering. Oh, we recommend starting with voice command training mode before playing. Have fun. Hmm, okay, I don't know what that training mode is, but we'll find out. Preparation, remove all package materials and everything, all the attachments, all the strings and everything. 
three AA batteries, full function normal place, which the function. What does it say? For function for full function normal play, switch the function selector to off for five seconds. Then to play, press any of the three talk buttons on okay, that's what I wanted to know as well. Try me function is uh Okay. Buttons uh no, not buttons. Um batteries are on the wings on the back like always. Wings and backpack push wings and rotate as shown. Okay. Alright. Battery car. Okay. First page. Live mode with moving head. Buzz behaves like a real person, just like in the film. Press the red or green button to talk to start playing. Okay, red and green. Red and green. Okay. Voice commands. Hello, buddy. Someone's coming. Quiet. Go to sleep. Okay, no one's here. It's going to take me a while to get those memorized, but okay. Hello, buddy. Buzz will respond to the voice command by moving his head while saying. Drop and freeze. Copy that. Buzz drops on command. Tell Buzz someone is coming. Or say to quiet, go to sleep, and he will stop, freeze, and drop. Just like in the movie. He will stay still and stop moving his head. If you repeat another command, Buzz will... <laughs> okay. He, Buzz will speak quietly to you to acknowledge it. Afterwards, Buzz will switch to toy mode and remain there for 30 seconds until you give him another toy command. No one's here. Or hello, buddy. When the coast is clear... He will wake up from toy mode and his head will move. If Buzz is lying down, man, well, what I thought is that these would get back up by themselves. And that's why they're, like, that's why Woody is like this and that he can um, stand on his own. So, I mean, maybe that's too advanced for these toys. But I thought these were able to stand back up by themselves. That's a little bit disappointing for me because, well, I mean, it is on the box. It does say drop down action. It doesn't say drop down and back up action. But maybe there's a method how... Some uh, someone out there who knows about engineering more than I do knows how to flick a switch or something inside to make them stand up by themselves. But for now, they can only fall on command. You may also play with Buzz in live mode by pressing the red or green button. What does the blue button do then? It's not mentioning anything about the blue button. Talk mode. It's just repeating a lot of the stuff. Blue is a space ranger talking. Oh, okay. There's the blue. Blue is for the toy. To exit toy mode, press red or green. And say, hello, buddy. Or no one's here. Voice commanding training mode. All right. To help Buzz recognize your voice, we recommend you go through the training mode. Press and hold the blue button for three seconds to activate training mode. Buzz will t take you through his force. Okay, let's go through that. All right. Like, we'll start with um, Buzz Lightyear then. All right. Hello, buddy. Right. One more time, please. Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. Perfect. Here comes the next one. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Right. One more time, please. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Perfect. Here comes the next one. Quiet. Go to sleep. Quiet. Go to sleep. Right. One more time, please. Quiet. Go to sleep. Quiet. Go to sleep. Perfect. Here comes the next one. Okay, no one's here. Okay, no one's here. Right. One more time, please. Okay, no one's here. Okay, no one's here. Perfect. Training completed. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, that was actually pretty cool. It reminded me a lot about how you set up your iPhone with Siri. For you iPhone fans out there, you would say, Hey, Siri, and then... You have multiple um, sessions where you repeat a phrase over and over. That's what this is reminding me of. <laughs> that was really cool. I enjoyed that. And, I mean, we get to do it again with Woody. So we'll put Buzz to the side for a bit. And we'll compare him to the other um, Thinkway Signature Collection version in just a bit. But for now, oh goodness, I feel like he's just going to fall on me. Let's take a look quickly at Woody. It's basically some of the same information. But here, you pull the string on the back for the toy mode and talk button on the fake buttons and unfortunately this isn't um an actual vest it's just printed on unfortunately preparation we've read about that same commands uh let's see here oh 
Okay, button activation. Live mode, pressing the talk button on his tummy. Or toy mode, I'm guessing, will be the string. Yeah, talk mode. Press Woody's talk button. Okay, yeah, so the button. That's for talking to exit talk mode. Say voice command or leave Woody. Toy mode. Head stay still. All right. Toy mode is basically the string. Basically how the signature ones work as well. You would press Buzz's red button to hear him as a toy. To infinity and beyond. And for Woody, you would pull his string. I'm not going to pull his string because then it's going to wake him up. But, uh, yeah, voice training mode. Let's get into this. Um, after five incorrect entries of the same command, Woody will exit training mode. All right. You may skip to the last command and correctly say, okay, no one's coming two times. Okay. To complete an exit training mode, the command, okay, no one's here, must be soaking. Okay. Um, press the talk button while pulling the string and hold both for three seconds. Let's go through it. One, two. Remember, a good deputy here we go. has got to take orders. So, you just listen to me, and then we'll see if you can repeat it back. Got it? Got it. And here we go. Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. Good. Go on and try again. Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. Perfect. Now the next one. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Good. Go on and try again. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Perfect. Now the next one. Quiet. Go to sleep. Quiet. Go to sleep. Good. Go on and try again. Quiet. Go to sleep. Quiet. Go to sleep. Perfect. Now the next one. Okay. No one's here. Okay. No one's here. Good. Go on and try again. Okay. No one's here. Okay, no one's here. Perfect. Great work, deputy. That's it? All right. Well, I guess we're ready to test them out. Um, I'm still going to need these things to guide me. Oh, look at that. The battery's on the bottom of his feet. And that's how you turn them on. For Buzz, we know it's on under his stomach. Or not under his stomach. It's right, right there, as you can see in the corner right there. Um... Uh, Let's go from there. Let's, let's test out Woody. Oh, you know what? Let's compare him real quick to this version right here. So straight off the bat, I'm noticing that this detailing is gone right here. Same for his um his belt. Um, hands seem the same from what I'm seeing, or similar at least in skin tone and everything. Face sculpt seems the same. I'm thinking this one's a little bit chubbier, maybe because of the mechanics in there. Uh, the hats. There's no detailing like that on here, or string separate string detailing on there either. So in a sense, it's less detailed. Move the hats for a bit. He is slightly taller, this new one right here for Toy Story 4. Um, fake badge, unfortunately. No detailing on here either. Legs are stiff here. Legs are wobbly here. Looking at the boots right there, you can see the differences. Very drastic differences right there. Differences on that um, holster right there. Move both of their arms. Now coming to the back. No detailings on the hair either. Wow, it's not very detailed. That's what I'm not liking. But other than that, everything is fine. And there's the base, if anyone's interested. That's where you put in the batteries. And I guess we'll put uh, Woody to the side, the signature collection. But I do know that all of the phrases on here are the same as the signature collection, except like two of them. Hello, buddy. Listen. You're my favorite deputy. That one's on the signature. There's a snake in my boot. This one as well, exactly the same. Reach for the sky. This one as well, I believe. This town ain't big enough for the two of us. This one for sure. This one as well. We gotta get this wagon train a moving. You're my favorite deputy. This one as well. I'd like to join your pub. This one boys, isn't. But first I'm so it's good that we have new phrases on this one. Oh, this one either. On this one's not on there either. Where the deer and the antelope play. So that's two. This town ain't All right, so big two. enough for the two of us. Two new phrases. But um, ah, Woody, don't fall. 
Okay, no one's here. Don't worry, no one's getting replaced. <laughs> okay. All right, let's um, see if I can even stand him up. All right. Hello, buddy. Hey, howdy, hey. Okay, no one's here. Say, you want to be my deputy? Great, you'll be great. Someone's coming. That didn't work. Someone's coming. Oh, brother, not again. Oh, goodness. <laughs> no. <laughs> no one's here. Time. Oh. My neck was getting stiff. <laughs> oh. It fell the wrong way. It's supposed to fall back. Someone's coming. Really? We'll talk later. There we go. There we go. Oh, okay, there you go. That's how he works, basically. Um, okay, no one's here. Let me know if you see anyone. <laughs> that was close. Could you help me up, partner? Yes, sir, I will. Okay, no one's here. Great. Time to saddle up for adventure. I think it's because I'm on carpet that 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 happened where he ah uh, yeah. In a bit we'll go to um a hard floor surface and we'll show that in better detailing for Woody because I mean he is a lot more unstable than let's say Buzz Lightyear. And we're gonna take a look at Buzz Lightyear now. Here's Buzz. Retractable helmet. No laser unfortunately. Here are how the wings pop out. You pull them out. A little bit stiff but they do come out in comparison to this one right here this is an intergalactic emergency you press the button they come out so i guess we'll compare them now together oh yeah okay i'm seeing the differences this is a lot squishier this is a lot harder it's got a laser this one doesn't Obviously different hand molds. This one can move all of his fingers. No problemo and this one can't move them at all There are the faces Star command arm over here. This one does not have star command on him while well, this one does There are these sides bottom of the feet Yes, yeah, he's got the laser these feet do not bend or do not have articulation there's the base. Yeah, so these don't bend. Don't try to bend them or they're gonna break. He has to be loose so he can fall back. Helmet, no noise. Helmet, noises and sound effects and everything. The back, I don't know why they didn't put those details in there. Very simple details that they could have just put on there. Side of the jet pack. That's pretty much it. We press his um, toy button right here. Hello, buddy. Someone's coming. I knew it. This isn't, isn't this supposed to make him a toy, though? I protect the galaxy there you go. from threat of invasion. To infinity and beyond! Yeah, that does not sound like um, to, uh, Tim Allen, sorry. I am Buzz Lightyear. This one is Tim Allen. Buzz Lightyear, to the rescue! I am Buzz Lightyear. I protect the galaxy from the threat of invasion. I come in peace. And then this one. I come in peace. Yeah. This is an intergalactic emergency. Buzz Lightyear to the rescue. I am Buzz Lightyear. Do the arms move? Well, this one doesn't bend back. Both of them don't bend back like this one right here, where you can like do some punches and everything. But the rest is the same, where this can move inwards, this can go outwards. It, go, it can go 360, which that other one can't do. Hands do move. Hands don't go down. They're always stuck like that. I'm guessing that's his microphone. I don't know where Woody has his. I don't see it. Could be under the fabric, but who knows? Let's test out Buzz Lightyear now, shall we? We'll put him with the helmet on and everything. Press the blue button. Someone's coming. Oh, the, the the helmet opens and everything. That's that is great. I like that. Let's try that again with the helmet open this time. Okay, no one's here. Let me know if you see someone coming. Hello, buddy. Hello to you too, Ned. Hello, Buzz. 
I guess he can only respond to those four commands. Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. And a great big hello right back at you. Hmm. Are you ready for an adventure? Uh, someone's coming. I knew it. <laughs> oh, I knew it. That's great. I don't know. I feel more attached to I feel more attached to Woody. I don't know why. It's just maybe it's because Buzz is way chunkier and his features aren't really there. Um, but I don't know. I like both of them. Don't get me wrong, but I think I prefer Woody out of the two of them. And if they had a Jesse, oh, I'd totally go for Jesse because I'm a huge fan of Jesse, the character herself. Um, let's see. In the, I'm looking at the instructions here. Okay, no one's here. <laughs> Maybe I need to change the batteries because he's not sounding too loud. Quiet, go to sleep. <laughs> yeah, I could use a little hypersleep. <laughs> okay, that one that one was funny. Oh yeah, I can use a bit of hypersleep. That one was great. I like that line. Alright. Okay, no one's here. Yep. Looks like everything is back to normal. Quiet, go to sleep. <sighs> okay. We'll play later. That's great. I mean, the fact that he interacts with you and everything and his phrases are they make sense when you talk to him that's great i honestly like that and the fact that woody doesn't need a stand to stand up anymore is, is great as well i did forget to mention you can bend his legs up and down but not right here not at this point just up and down which is something buzz cannot do I yeah no buzz's legs are stuck like that so now i'm going to try both of them What do you, yeah, you know what, you know what, let's go to the hard um, floor and test these two out together. Alrighty, so we are going to do a couple of tests. This is test number one on the hard surface floor. Someone's coming. Okay, got it. So only Buzz fell. Quiet, someone's coming. Got it, got it, thanks. Hmm, someone's coming. Let's try this again. Someone's coming. Okay, as you can see, that was a very late reaction. Let me reset these guys. All right, test number two. This should work this time. Quiet, go to sleep. Buzz Lightyear, over and out. That sounds like a great idea. Quiet, someone's coming. Mm, okay, we'll play later. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Quiet now. Quiet. Someone's coming. Got it. Got it. Thanks. Quiet. Or what do you say? Quiet. Someone's coming. Copy that. Okay, so Woody's having a bit of trouble reacting to those uh, um, those words is what I'm noticing. Buzz is doing a great job of reacting. Okay, no one's here. Great. Now, uh, where were we? My neck was Finally. Stiff. Oh. Now, could you help me out by... Seem to be a little... <laughs> Can you help me up, partner? All right, let's do another test. All right, I did want to point out what they say when they get up. So if we pick up Buzz. Okay, coast is clear. Oh, that, no, that's not one of the phrases. Hello, buddy. Yep, looks like everything is back Time to normal. for a roundup. <laughs> oh, that was close. Could you help me up, partner? All right, let's pick Thanks. up Buddy. Oh, hey, uh, could you help me gather up everyone? Sure, um, give you your hat. I'm st it's gonna take me a while to get used to their phrases that triggers them to fall down. Um, someone's coming! Yeah, see? Someone's coming! Okay, got it. Hmm, someone's coming. Really? We'll talk later. So Woody's a late reactor, okay. or is... we'll play later. Either Woody reacts late, or I have no idea, because... If I say, hello, buddy. Hey, hey. Okay, <laughs> that everyone, was a close one. let's get back to Finally. play time. <laughs> now, could you help oh, me out, buddy? Seem to be a little up, <laughs> stuck. He reacts to when I say no one's here. Thanks. It is great to see you, my friend. Thanks. Get it up, partner. Ride like the wind. Interesting, interesting. Uh, we'll do one more test without Woody's hat. Quiet, someone's coming. Hmm, none of them heard me. 
What's the phrase again? The one that says quiet. Oh, quiet, go to sleep. Quiet, go to sleep. <laughs> That's great. He's, sn he's snoring and everything. That little details like those in the voice box are amazing. S quiet, someone's coming. Someone's coming. Quiet now. Quiet. Hmm, Woody doesn't like responding to that. Someone's coming. Copy that. Someone's coming. Hmm. Giddy up, partner! We gotta get this wagon train a moving. That's strange. You know, let's do one more test just for Woody. Okay, no one's here. Let me know if you see anyone. Okay. Hello, buddy. Great. Good to see you, Debbie. Where were we? Woody? All right, I think Buzz is gonna fall as well, so we might as well just have him in the shot. But I just want, I just, oh wait, we can just put him in the toy mode. Quiet, go to sleep. Okay, so when you press one of these two buttons, we'll play later. that's when he turns into a toy, and he'll just go to sleep. And then you can use him as a toy. To infinity and beyond. And for some reason, his wings pop out. But I, I was expecting that even before I even saw um videos about this which currently there isn't many, and I'm hoping mine is one of the top five for recommendations when you search up this toy product because there's not a lot of reviews out there. And I was really, really interested in these when I heard they were um, first announced. So I went for it and I liked them, but um, of course, we still got a bunch of testing to do with Woody specifically because he's a bit of a re late responder. Someone's coming. Did you press this button? Quiet, go to sleep. Got it. He's gonna fall. All right. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Hmm. There's a snake in my boat. Quiet. Someone's coming. Copy that. So Woody isn't responding, huh? Reach for the sky. Someone's coming. All right. Got it. Okay. No one's here. Let right. me know if you Time see to saddle up for adventure. Finally. Now, could you help me up? I seem well, to be a little <laughs> stuck. Buzz responds very well, but not Woody. Someone's coming. Yeah. Someone's coming. Now none of them are reacting. It's going to take me a while to understand their systems. Someone's coming. Hmm. I'd like to join your posse, boys. But first, I'm going to sing a little song. Someone's coming. Quick! We're in position! All right, now he works. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Hmm. Hello? Okay, no one's here. I guess he can't oh, say hi, close. buddy. Or unless it's Thanks. hello, buddy. Have you seen Buzz? You know, Buzz Lightyear, space suit, light bulb, laser. All right, I think, I think it's not the toys that are the problem. It's just me and my, my brain that can't process or remember the phrases. Someone's coming. Or maybe it's them. Hello, buddy. Now Come tell on. me, what it's kind of toy? Let's move. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Oh, oh brother, not again. So you got a shot at him. It's not sensitive like the Thinkway signature collection ones where you would just say something or just the slightest little noise and he would like start talking. Okay, no one's here. This sounds a lot like Tom Hanks, I'm telling you. Well, this one doesn't sound very accurate to um, Tim Allen. I could be completely wrong, who knows. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Really? No, we'll talk later. Hmm, maybe it's just because my phone is in the way and my voice just gets blocked. Okay, no one's here. The post is clear. Looks like everything Great. is back to normal. Are we, Finally. I'm thinking I just need to now get him new batteries. Because Buzz is be reacting <laughs> very well. Stuck. But here we go with the last test for these two. We'll have Buzz in a saluting position. Helmet closed. Wings popping out, because um, why not? Let's see if I can even get them out. So you pull down the wings and then you pick them up. Let's try this. And Woody's hat, of course. So here's 
One last test before we go. Someone's coming. Perfect. Pros and cons for Woody and Buzz. Um, the pros for Woody, he caught my attention a lot more than Buzz because Buzz's features are not there, like his wrist communicator and the laser and the wings don't light up and you can't bend his, um, his legs. That's one of the cons for him. But for Woody, the pros is that you can bend his legs and since he's just a pull string toy, it's just a little bit of lack of detail in the vest. Um, the cons for Woody though, uh, well yeah, it's cons for both of them is detail, pros for them, they work great. Just maybe the batteries that I needed to replace before playing, like the box and the suggestions of the instructions told me to. But for the video, we used the in-store batteries to play with them. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you all so much for watching. Remember to leave a like, leave a comment, and follow us on Instagram at Piston Cup Productions for more channel exclusive content. This is Piston Cup Productions signing out. See you all next time. Now, as far as Disney cars, I did recently get Case J of 2019 singles from Get Me Collectibles. I was debating where I, whether I should um, review this case or not. But in the end, I decided to cancel this um, review on this case. Yes, it has a lot of new releases, and I did have a lot to talk about, especially with Carl Clutchin in there and Sterling with headset, um, the new Heyday River Scott, the other um, Docks Racing Day Legends um, releases, more Thomasville characters, um, Thunder Hollow characters, and Cotterpin characters as well. But in the end, I decided not to review the case, and also that Fireball Beach Chem Spinner that I got recently, because I'm... Well, first of all, I'm getting pushed back because it's around the time for school finals. School is getting in the way. Um, I need to concentrate on the finals for school. But as soon as school is over, by May 31st, around that time when I get out or earlier, um, it's back to cars, racing like a legend, finish that movie up, going to record at San Francisco for the, for the movie as well because it is going... I've changed the plot completely. I haven't announced this officially, but the plot has changed drastically since when I first announced this movie. Um, the characters are also going to change. There's going to be... I was going to use the Thomas for Racing Legends, but I am still in the development of this film. A lot of the characters and a lot has changed ever since I announced this film. I hope you all understand. Piston Cup Productions, signing out. Until next time.